Hello my friends, welcome to my channel. I got a great show for you today. I'm gonna review some uh, tortilla shells that I found recently that are new and they are zero net carbs. I'm gonna give them a try for you today and actually gonna make them on a, um, a sandwich, egg and cheese sandwich that I like to make for breakfast. And I'm gonna show you a little bit how I do that. And uh, let's get into it. Okay, my friends, we're gonna talk about Mission's Zero Net Carb Original Shells. These are, as it says on the package here, there's seven grams of uh, carbs and seven grams of fiber, therefore giving you zero net carbs. So this is basically a great low carb, I'm gonna call it low carb. Uh, some people will say it's keto, but uh, you know, some people argue different and that's, that's not what this is about. This is just to review this taco shell and what I think of it. Now there's the original here and they also make um, a sun-dried tomato one as well. I've actually had some of these. I'll give you some ideas for these too. Uh, today I'm trying this on a breakfast sandwich though, so let's get into it. Okay guys, just wanted to give you some of the details of the Mission uh, Zero Carb, Zero Net Carb uh, tortilla shells. As you can see, it is keto certified. It's high in fiber. And uh, also there's uh, shells here. There's 14 sh uh, shells in a package. This package I picked up at Walmart, I wanna say it's about 389, uh, if I remember right. Uh, same thing with the tomato basil one. And there's 25 calories each. Total fat is one and a half grams, uh, zero cholesterol, 125 milligrams of sodium. Carbohydrates, seven. However, you do have the dietary fiber of seven grams. So you take seven minus seven and that gives you the zero net carbs. Um, that's where they're getting that. Um, and it's got two grams of protein in it. Um, they're small, as you can see the size of my hand. I mean, they're a little bit bigger than the size of my palm, not much. So they're not real big, but um, definitely are, are worth taking a look at. Okay guys, a little change of pace here. I'm gonna whip up an egg and cheese sandwich here. Um, usually I just pick, I'm just gonna take one egg since these shells are pretty small. I'm gonna whisk it here with a fork and make sure you spray your pan with some uh, cooking oil. I just used an olive oil spray. Um, that's fairly healthy for you and that'll help make sure it doesn't stick, or, stick in the pan. Okay, one thing I like to do is put a little salt and pepper on here. I'm using my automatic uh, salt and pepper um, shakers to add some nice flavor. Next thing we're going to do is add some cheese here. I should have probably just put this cheese right in the middle and then fold it over the ends. Um, I ended up more with like a half omelet shape, which is okay. I don't care too much. I'm, I'm not a cooking show here. But uh, just getting this ready to go. We're going to put it between two tortillas soon. Okay, this is ready to go. Let's give it a try. I love egg and cheese sandwiches. They're probably one of my favorites. Um, this is the first time I've tried it on a tortilla shell though. But just to kind of give you an idea of what the, the tortilla shell tastes like, it's very soft, much like bread super soft compared to some of the other tortillas out there. Um, you know, it's got good flavor. It's kind of bland, um, but most bread is. Um, obviously, I think it's a great substitute for bread, uh, especially if you're on a low carb diet, uh, which I have started this week myself. And I'm trying to, to eat right and take off some weight, as a lot of people are, or a lot of people are just trying to stay fit. Clearly, I'm a big guy. I've got a lot of weight to lose, but uh, I'm going to give this a try and see how it goes. So far, so good for the week. But uh, I tell you what, I'm going to come back with my final thoughts on what I think of this taco shell and give you some more ideas on what you can cook with these. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, just wanted to give you my final thoughts on these. Um, 
right here. I sampled these before. Today is the first day I've tried these. Um, I did it on the egg and cheese sandwich. It was very good, guys. Nice and soft, a great substitute for bread, and it's got zero net carbs. So a uh, great item if you're on a low carb diet or maybe the keto diet. Um, they're high in fiber, which is good. Um, great taste, you know, they, they're a nice substitute for bread. What, uh, I made an egg and cheese sandwich today with these. I know I've made a quesadilla with these. You put a slice of cheese in there. I made them simple, rolled them, uh, just threw it in the microwave for, you know, like 12 seconds. Uh, just used two shells and I had a little mini quesadilla. Great little snack or a great lunch. Um, the other thing you could use these for is uh, like hamburgers. Use this as, as a substitute for a bun. Um, you know, make some smash burgers, use these. You can make pizzas in the oven with these. Um, put this in the oven and warm it up, get it crisped up a little bit. You know, put your pizza sauce on, your cheese. You know, you're gonna want a low carb pizza sauce um, on that and then some pepperoni or whatever topping that's low carb. Throw it in the oven for a little bit till the cheese is melted and you've got yourself pizza. The other thing I was thinking with these when I was making a quesadilla is why not put some butter on the outside and put it in a fry pan and make grilled cheese. You can make grilled cheese with these just to give you a couple more ideas. Um, you know, but overall the tomato basil, it definitely has a different flavor than the original. The original are more like just a traditional top uh, flour tortilla shell. This one, it's similar. I would say it's a little bit harder, not as soft. Um, it does have a little bit different taste to it because of the tomato basil, nothing overpowering or anything, um, but um, they're both fine. I think these are a great product, especially if you're on some kind of low carb diet or a keto diet, you know, you're gonna wanna pick these up. These are a brand new item from Mission and you'll see them right with all the other Mission um, tortillas. Um, don't be afraid to give them a try. I'm gonna continue buying these. I'm gonna give you a rating today. I'm gonna to rate these a nine. And the reason being is I'm gonna keep buying them. They, they taste fine. I think they're a great substitute for bread and you can use it for a lot of different things. You know, make a pan, you know, it's just one of those things that you can do a lot of creations with it. Um, you know, I'm kind of new in the, the low carb diet thing, but uh, I'm definitely gonna be, you know, you could easily make some sandwiches with these, ham and cheese sandwich, uh, turkey and cheese. Uh, there's just so many different things that you can make with these. So you're gonna wanna give them a try, guys. Like I said, I'm gonna give these a nine today. And uh, that's what I do here on this channel. I review different products, different things. Sometimes I make things like I did today, showing you how I made that egg and cheese sandwich. You know, that thing only took probably three minutes to make. Uh, it wasn't a big deal. Probably five by the time you sit down, but you know, five minute breakfast, you can't beat that. I'm gonna give today's product a big thumbs up. And uh, if you like the video, give me another big thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. You might want to hit that subscribe button too, because I do uh, daily, pretty much daily reviews and release them. Um, you, like I said, you're going to see a little more uh, probably keto, low carb friendly meals that I'll, I'll be reviewing more of those type of products. Um, but I will throw in other stuff as well. So keep that in mind. Hey, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time, friends. Take care. God bless. Bye.